Okay, another HQS custom video. Today I'm gonna show you how to shave the door handles on this 16 Impala. I'm gonna show you how to cover this hole up here. That one, and if you can see, it's not perfectly flat. So we need to take that down, weld it in. Same thing on this one here. This one's flat, so we just have to make a piece that will go weld it inside. When you're doing this, you need to clean the metal really good. You wanna use the, I use this wheel, wire brush wheel. I do not use a flapper wheel like this. You can to clean the metal real good, but when you're grinding with this, you can uh, the metal's gonna get really thin on you, and that's when your welding skills gonna be uh, a lot stronger. So to avoid any thin metal and welding problems with the heat. I'll just clean up with the wire brush wheel. Okay, we have a clean metal here, bare metal. That's what you want to see and how you want to prepare it. Okay, HQS Customs here. I'm going to show you how to make a template to cover that hole up. You get a piece of paper. This is kind of thick. All I do is put it over it and I just rub it across go X pattern this is just in case you can't get it from the back side and mark it but this is another way you see that it's perfect so you cut that out of the sheet metal put it in there and weld it in okay I have the two pieces made here those two holes and I have this uh, super magnets that I use. And I use you can use whatever you want. I use this as a as a handle, but you'll see what I'm gonna, about to do right now. So they're pretty strong, so they'll hold in place. And if you come over here, it'll fit just perfect. Okay, so we'll we'll fit it, tack it, weld it all in. You could watch other YouTube channels about welding. You could uh, use a MIG welder, TIG welder. I have them both. It's your preference. Whatever you're more comfortable with. So that one fits good. Same thing with this one. And you can see that's a circle. And there's little spots on there. There's four of them. That's all right. You fill it in with the welder. You grind it off. Ready to go. Okay, after you weld the pieces in and you grind it off to your likings, you're ready for this uh, body filler. And you could uh, use lead to fill everything in, grind it down, leave it pure bare metal, or you could put body filler right on top of this. Um, however you prefer, either way that's welded in and it'll be, it'll last forever. Okay, so here's the close to finish uh, product of the shave door handles. So you could, uh, as you got a little low spot here, there's an edge around it, and a little bit right there. And really it's up to you, you could go ahead and uh, use body filler now, go for it, but you know, our you can use lead to fill that in and then do some more metal body work. It's up to you really. But this is it's welded in. Once you uh, put a DTM on it, do body work, it'll last forever. And it's not gonna crack. Okay, here is the welding after. Cover the one hole there. The other hole there and the keyhole you can see now I can use the lead and finish that off same thing here especially that little low spot there little spot um, or if you prefer you can use the body filler and cover it up you have to clean it really good though prior to that it's your your choice